Hello Elites and welcome back to Minecraft Elite vs Wild, this is episode 126, I'm sorry that video has not gone out in a while, I've been busy doing other secret projects on YouTube, but we're back and I'm ready to catch up, so be ready to watch like 10 episodes one day probably, not really, but you know, just a few episodes in like a week. So right here in this area, that I haven't built in for a long time, but I flattened it out and got it ready, we're going to be building um, this picture I'm about to put on the screen, there, and uh, let's get these things in the water. Kill them. Kill them. There we go. Um, so we're going to be building a tribute to one of my favorite old video games from back in the day. I used to play this game called Whiplash. It was a cute little game about being a weasel and rabbit and you're escaping this facility that tests on animals and shit like that. And they have this giant ass building that has like so many different kinds of rooms in it. And it's huge on the inside, but on the outside it doesn't look that big. It's crazy, right? And um, I want to build that building because it's so cool looking. It's weird. It doesn't it looks like it should it's out of like it looks like it's out of place because there's like 20 different like designs on it. So we're going to start with it and um, with the picture I'm I'm going to be stopping every once in a while just standing here, standing still. Don't uh, be weirded out. That's just me sitting here looking to, to my side real quick to look at my um, phone to see the design of the building. Right now we're going to build a corner, but I think we're going to start with the right corner, which is going to have those factories as you saw. Uh, I might have the picture up on the screen for a long time, um, just to show like uh, what it looks like. Maybe I'll pop it up every minute of the video, just to keep showing you like, and I'll probably make it a little bit transparent so you can see through it a little bit and see through the video, um, just so you can see what it looks like. It's not going to be perfect, okay, because it's cartoony. It's a very cartoony building, so it's not realistic so minecraft obviously can't replicate it right exactly the way it's supposed to be but it's okay we'll make it look as similar as possible and you'll be able to recognize it if you play this game if you know who, what game this is so right now we're building those giant blocks of like factoriness on the side of the building that there is and uh, i'm gonna go ahead and cut out a lot of this so it's gonna be probably a very short video so i'll be right back okay Alrighty, and we are back and i am going to make the flooring um Sea lanterns. Uh, just so it doesn't spawn mobs inside when you walk by the building at night, it's just like, Rrr, and then all you hear is that, and you hear little spiders and all kinds of bullshit. Um, you know, we're gonna make it lit up so you don't hear shit at night when you walk by this building, and so it's not like full of crap. Um, I don't think we're gonna make this building functional. I think it's just gonna be more like, you know, it's there to design. So it's gonna be one of those empty buildings, but um, and not as empty. There's a difference between the empty buildings I have in a city that I haven't like burnished yet. Those are will those will be furnished and like full of like different companies and stuff like that that you guys will choose like hey I want a company here I'll be like okay you can own this much of the building or however much you want and uh, stuff like that but then there's a difference between this which is just decoration um I think this is purely the only one that's decoration everything else might not be so this might be the first building in my city that's just decoration it's not even for use at all. It will never be furnished. It's just for looks. And I might tear it down in the future, you know, blah, blah, blah. And then, okay, so in the picture, we're going to add these uh, little, like, pipelines on the side of the building. They're, like, weird little pipelines that go along it and probably carry, like, toxic waste and stuff like that and all kinds of weird stuff. Um, whenever I play the game, I always try looking at the building, pictures of the building. I'm always like, I wonder what area I'm in, in what level, you know? But you can never tell. It just kind of never... It gave you like a clear hint of what it was, you know? So, alright. I think the building was just pretty much thrown together and drawn real quick. I don't think they paid attention to detail. Alright, so then we're going to um, make this curve because these pipes curve. There's like these giant thick round pipes that curve onto another uh, giant smokestack tower thing. So we're going to go ahead and... Build these. Okay, curviness is a little difficult with blocks, of course. So let's see. Let's start it here. Let's make it kind of three wide. So three wide. Here you go. But that looks a little awkward here. So let's add one more line. I think that's good enough. Yeah. All right. And now let's make it three wide or three depth wise. Um, like this. All right. And then one more layer. And uh, I might cut this second pipe out because it's the same exact thing as the first one. And I want to—I really don't want to bore you guys. I want to make my videos really snappy and really quick. Unless some of you do like um, videos that, you know, you watch and go through that. 
which I don't. Lately, I've been impatient about life because I'm like, I want to pull up already. I want to do things. So, um, because, you know, when you graduate high school, you feel like that. When you're in high school, you kind of feel jailed. You know, you feel like you can't grow up, <laughs> which I'm happy I'm finally out. So, um, we're going to go ahead and, oh, I missed one right there. Okay. And I missed one right here. Well, damn. All right. And, um, I don't think I'm going to cut out yet, actually. Sorry, I'm talking so much about editing. It's because it's for the sake of me recording this video. I'm so freaking pissed. That was my phone. <laughs> yes, my, my phone is the white chick's the, um, ringtone of, I'm so freaking pissed. I came off the table, look at my freaking shred. So that's what my <laughs> thing is. Um, man, people are, <laughs> leave me alone. Anyways, um, uh, okay, so there's the pipe. And yeah, I'm talking so much about editing because I'm recording this an hour and a half before work. So I kind of, it seems like I have a lot of time, but I really don't because I like to leave like an hour or less um, before work and get there early. I don't know. I'm just that kind of person. I'm punctual as fuck. I'm overly punctual. So, you know, that's how I feel. So I'm going to go ahead and clean this up. We're going to add this. Um, okay. There's another pipe here that like connects from the bottom of, or the top of this smokestack, and goes like towards another wall. So we need to build this other smokestack. How are we gonna build this? It looks like it's overlapping this other one, perhaps? I don't know how I'm gonna do this. How am I gonna execute this? Okay. I don't wanna leave it floating either, cause then it's just an eyesore. Uh, hmm. And um, also guys, I wanna let you know, if you have any suggestions for buildings that come from video games just like this one go ahead and suggest it and i'll i'll try to build it <laughs> if i if i really feel up the, up to the challenge because you know oh god some of them are crazy like i want one day i want to build the ultor building from saints row 2 but that looks difficult as hell because how are you supposed to get triangles and angles like that how in minecraft just tell me <laughs> we can't so that's going to be difficult figuring out so let's go ahead and fill up this wall I i'm going to cut right here Alrighty, and we're back. I had finished this smokestack tower thing, the second one. That's behind that one, as you can see. That's kind of what it looks like in the picture. Um, we're paying attention to, de to detail in the front. So the way we'll build this building is from the front view, and then everything on the back view will look kind of like a cardboard layout, like cutout kind of thing, where it's just like brown cardboard on the back and not like a picture on the back. So um, after we build the building, we're going to make it look better by uh, going back and going through the back and making it look like, you know, actual parts of the building too instead of just being like a um metaphoric cardboard cutout <laughs> you know what i mean it's just like oh it has a picture on the front but when you look at the back it's just a stand that's all you see it's just brown and then a stand <laughs> so we don't want the building to be like that we don't want it to be all flat and like boring in the back because this city is 360 you're going to be able to go around all everywhere so um you want the back to be as interesting as the front especially for a lot of buildings that are in the center of the city a lot of the ones that are on the edge of the city don't really need a beautiful back because, well, maybe for the view on the ocean, but, like, not as much as, um, you know, the front should be pretty and beautifully designed. Um, yeah. Okay, so we're building the smoke stack here, and I do not like this design. I'm, like, trying to concentrate on, like, how to do this while I'm talking, and I'm fucking myself up. So let's focus on this. So we're going to do this instead. We're going to make it like this because it goes kind of smaller. Um... And of course, again, Minecraft won't let me do like a cylindrical shape that starts out with a higher radius on um, one end and then a smaller radius on the other end, meaning it shrinks a little bit towards the top. So we're going to make it look tiered a little bit, kind of like this, Minecraft style. Um, okay, it needs to be a little bit taller, just a little bit. A little bit. I feel like the second half of it should be a little bit taller than the first half, just to give it that kind of like height. Okay, that looks better. Or maybe if they're equal size. I'm trying to really look at it in the picture too. Um, I like it. It's not bad so far. It's very basic. Trust me, we'll add plenty of design to it. Right now, it's just gonna be the the cake, and then later we'll add like you know fondant and like little cutout designs and all kinds of shit like that. We're literally comparing a building to a cake as a metaphor. <laughs> so. Alright, we're gonna do strips because it it looks like it's like different colors of gray. So that's perfect because we have um 
this quartz texture that is gray in this texture pack, and then we also have the texture of iron, which are like both metallic, which I love. I love this texture pack. I love the city texture pack. It was well worth the dollar I paid. So you're welcome, 4J, <laughs> for that dollar. All right. There we go. We're going to make these strips all the way around. And then <clears throat> we're going to look at the next part of the building to build. It looks like there's maybe a third section of this factory area, this industrial part of the building. And then we'll move on to, like, I still haven't built the smokestack. Uh, there's another smokestack. Okay, so there's that. And there's, this another, there's another smokestack that's behind this one that's taller. So, okay. <clears throat> Let's build one more layer. Like that. So that's even. So it's by twos, okay? All right. Mm, let's take a look at it. That's what it looks like so far. Pretty nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. It actually looks nice. Like I said, we're going to add way more details. So don't fret yet. All right, so it looks like there's another piece of concrete part right here. It doesn't look like anything. It just looks like a rectangular part. So we're going to go ahead and add that, and I will come right back. All righty, and here is what the factory looks like now. I, I went ahead and added some iron bars on top because um, it looks like it kind of has something on top of it. Um, I don't know if I really can zoom into the picture with editing-wise, but, you know, something like that. It, it looks like that. And then there's, like, another fucking – I should have built this more inland. But, you know what, I think we're just going to go ahead and wing it, and we're going to have to make this look like it's not floating. Make it look like it's actually, you know, there's more land behind this. Unfortunately, it's going to be floating a little bit over the canal, but that's okay. What improv it, we'll figure it out. And let me go ahead and build this part, because i got to figure this out. This is going to take me another five damn minutes, so I'll be right back. Alrighty, and now we are building... Uh, okay, so this is the big smokestack that's in the far back of the building. Um, it has, like, this weird, like, um, black pipeline kind of weird-looking electrical things um, going along the outside of the pipe, uh, the smokestack. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to try to replicate that um, using uh, dark oak fences. I don't like using um, nether brick fences anymore because they're, they have a reddish tint to them. And I like the dark oak fences because they look more black, especially at nighttime. So it looks a little bit more perfect, especially from the distance, too. Really up close, it looks dark brown, but from far, it looks black. So it's perfect for, like, um, charcoal colored designs like this. So let's actually make these all the same height. So let's look at that, this, and that. And let's step back and look at it and see if it looks kind of like it does in the tower. Okay, it does. I like it. I like it, I like it. Let's go ahead and add our own personal touch. Let's add some redstone torches to make it look like, you know, it has something to do with redstone. Make it turn on or something or make it waste less um, power, make it, you know, shit like that. So that's what it looks like. Um, the second, the first one doesn't have it, but the second one does. I don't know why. And actually, I think smokestacks really do have these kind of things in real life. I'm not really sure what it's for. If there's by chance any adult who's watching my videos and works, whoever worked in the industry like this, um, industrial industry, whatever, uh, knows what the fuck that is, <laughs> tell me. I'll teach everybody. I'll, we'll learn about it together because I don't know what the hell that is. So we're going to go ahead and build this other, it's not like a pipe, but it's like a little like circular, um, uh, like it looks like it has iron bars or something. Maybe like, maybe let's go. It's like a ventilation system on the side or something like yeah let's pollute the air around the building that's fine because genron is technically a corrupt company in the game that doesn't really give a shit because obviously their main goal is um animal testing that's illegal <laughs> and they don't give a fuck so uh, genron <laughs> i'm dead all right and let's go ahead and build this like little pipe on the side looks like it goes to the back of the building and there's this other one that's a little bit more forward. Mm -hmm. And it looks like it wraps around to the back. I'm going to go ahead and build this because this is really curvy. And uh, this is going to be a challenge. So I'm going to figure this out, okay? Alrighty, and now we are back. We finished the pipelines going to the side of that. It is a little bit of a floating chunk of a building. But you know what? Let's not mind it. Maybe maybe they have good technology for that. It's the future almost. Um... So yeah, that's what we got so far, the factory district area looking part. Uh, we will build more sections of it, you know, like the executive area, the power area, all kinds of other stuff like that that's in the game, if you know the game. 
um, stuff like that. So, guys, leave a like if you enjoyed this episode. Subscribe today to become an elite and not miss out any new content or uploads. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you haven't already, go ahead and um, hit that creeper. Hit that creeper. Oh, we're going to light this creeper on fire for our explosive ending. Go ahead and do it. Let's do it. Do it. Feel the roar. Boom. Look at that. All right.